All right, and I'm back, and it's in the bag. Um, I think I figured out how to get most of the treasure. I'm not entirely sure if I can get all of it, but I can get the two items I actually went here for. The only reason I went to level 4 and didn't stop at level 2. Um, so here's the stuff of striking. That's a bit tricky to get because I can't disarm traps. And there's a trap that most definitely can kill you. If you don't go about it perfectly. And that's in here. Um, I'm gonna leave that for now because the way I figured out to survive the trap <coughs> requires me to run the other direction and I wanna go here first See if I can survive the next trap. I'm not entirely sure if I can. That's why I quick save there. Oh, do we even have. Oh, yeah, okay. We have still have these. Oh, shit. That still hit me. How? I don't know how that still hit me. Um, so now I need to heal up. I'm just gonna use this because we have to sell it back anyway. Right, so here's an electric trap, so normally I should be able to survive it. Yeah, okay, nice. And I haven't been here before, so I don't know. If we can do this. No, okay, we need some kind of wardstone here. And I don't know which one. Mm. How many wardstones are there on this level? I don't really need this treasure, by the way. This is 14k gold and a lot of gems. But there might just be one single wardstone on this level. And I can get that wardstone. Um. The bone rune, that's what it's called. Yeah, maybe. That's what I need here. I'll try it. Um. Oops, phone is ringing. Let's actually load up a different save. This one. Okay, that didn't work. It's in the bag. I'm completely confused. There we go. Yeah, I think the first time I ever was in here, back when I first played this game, I must have spent hours in here. So there's a wardstone here. Um, I can't remember whether the trap is electric or fire. Let's definitely put on this. And I guess tank the rest of the damage. Manus. 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 
electric. Get this bone rune. And maybe, just maybe, we can open the other door with it. This is all pretty complicated. Oh, and while we're here, we might as well grab the sling. I just realized. Oops. Yes, this, the sling is here. Um, I have to kind of keep close to the wall here. Then no trap should trigger. <coughs> yeah, I can't grab everything here, sadly. And also, I think I'll need to drop something. Or I can't put the stuff in here. So I guess we're gonna drop this. And... For now, I guess we'll move on. There's so much stuff I still need. There was another wa wand of monster summoning. Wait, I completely forgot. Can I put this in here? Yes, I can. Okay. You can only hold a certain amount of um, uses, charges, whatever in this container. That's why this, for example, doesn't fit in. But since this is only five charges, I can still hold it. It's very nice. Why did I use up my invisibility already? An interesting question would be if I can rest in here, that would help me a lot. Nope. It's in the bag. Um, let's try whether we can rest with Islam. It's such a shame that I can't get the, can't easily get the compass wardstone. Or I would just teleport out and get back, but. Okay, this worked. No, it didn't. Okay. But I did rest for eight hours. Okay. That's all we need, actually. Alright. So we grabbed... ...the sling. Which also means we can just throw our sling away, yeah. So that's one inventory space less. So yeah, this is a huge upgrade to what we had. Obviously. Might as well stay like this for now. We're not gonna fight anyway. Um, so where was the wand of monster summoning again? I definitely need to grab that too. But I have to go back for this direction anyway, so... That's not a problem. Did I get the wardstone? Yeah, I get did. Okay, nice. Uh, a quick save here because you can get wrecked by that trap pretty easily. I wonder if it always hits. Or if you can outrun it. Like if you run far... No, okay. Okay, we can't. Alright. 
Oh wait, let's put on our Kiel's helmet before we drink that. Or we're gonna be in big trouble. Nice. And now put on these boots. I always have so much trouble finding this. You know what I should just do? Put both into my backpack. And then it's gonna go to the bottom if I put it back in. It's the last one anyway, but still. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure if I can open this now. Nope, I still can't open it. Alright, so there's something else locking that. And I have to be perfectly honest with you for just 14,000 gold and potentially having to put other stuff out of my pocket. And I, I just can't be bothered. I'm sorry. So I just get this, and this is pretty tricky to get. Um, we need to outrun the trap, and that's not really easy. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna precast Sanctuary. Grab this. I'm gonna grab both these items, but I'm probably not gonna be able to take both with me. We don't really need both. Now we're gonna run like our oh, life depended on it, because actually it does depend on it. And... Now... Before we do anything else, we're just gonna run this direction. Because it's safer. Oops. Now drink our goblet again. Oops. I've got the world's biggest ouchie. Where am I? Did I get stuck? I hope not. Because then I'm dead. Yeah, okay, we survived. So that's that trap. And I don't really need to, but I'm just gonna drink up the goblet again. I'm just gonna quickly try and find the wand of monster summoning. Oh, and this necklace, of course. That's very important, too. I'm gonna drop this here. Might return for it later, but I kind of doubt it. And yeah, I don't remember at all where the wand was. so annoying to have a to totally filled up pocket. I just should have thought I had before I went down here. But I didn't expect that I needed to have the compass wardstone to get back here. I didn't remember that part <coughs> at all. remember at all where the wand was. I could look it up, I guess. Right. Might as well grab whatever we can grab along the way. Maybe
maybe I should recast my sanctuary while I'm out of sight. I only need a single traveler, so I don't need to save these sanctuaries up or anything like that. Oh, okay, there it is. Nice. Yeah, so I could put this in here, so we have one more room. One more space, I should say. Because we shouldn't need it anymore. Oops, my phone is ringing. What are these braces? Um, I'll be right back. And I'm back. Um, yeah, so I don't know what to keep here. These braces... Or the long sword. Um, braces typically sell for a lot of money, but this is a pretty good long sword, so it might sell for more. Dropped it here somewhere. There we go. I really could use all these bullets plus two, but I just take up so much space. Wait. Come on. Thank you. So yeah, I'm gonna take the long sword. I'm not quite sure what sells for more, but we'll see. Probably could have used the Wands of Monster Summoning to help me against the Graal fight. But yeah, the problem with that is... I don't really need anything else but these items. I came here for the slim Sling and for the Staff and... Uh, this is not like a completionist playthrough. Um, the original plan was just to get through Baldur's Gate 1 and to prepare for SOD, get all the items I can get to help me through SOD. Alright. And yeah, as I might have mentioned before, I'm probably not going to take this character to SOD. But I still want to just finish this playthrough, finish this video series. And I've been running two characters on the side, a druid, a totemic druid, and since yesterday a dwarven defender, and I have yet to decide which one I'm going to take through SOD into Shadows of Am and through finally through Throne of Ball. But I think I might stick with the Druid. The Druid is pretty far into Baldur's Gate 1 already, almost as far as this character. And the Druid is just very powerful in Baldur's Gate 1 and SOD. Um, he is less powerful in Baldur's Gate 2 in TOB in the final levels. He's very strong in SOD, but he's less strong in TOB. But it probably is still more than enough. You said something? So, we're gonna sell this. And the rest needs to be identified. Wow, phone again. See you in a second. 